I need some herbs. I'm, I might even grow some more, yes, because I know that I'm going to use a lot. So let's do a few extra herbs for now. And then later, if we have a lot, we can decrease the amount. I'm probably going to make some seeds later so I can plant some of those flowers around town when I get a herbalist. Have you built a restaurant? Uh, not this time. We do have um, one house that I sort of made into like a uh, dining place. This one. Probably need to do a little bit more furnishing on it, but uh, this is like the inside. Some chairs and tables. A little donation box in the back. So maybe if they enjoyed the, the dinner, they can give a little bit of a donation. See that I also have to fix this one. There we go. Remove that template and save it again. Uh, but this one is probably the one they're going to be eating inside. But now that we're getting more decoration, we can put more things. Some Oh wow, those are really big. Maybe that should be sitting there instead of the donation box. Uh, but also, uh, we have these. We can put some wall scrolls. That would probably make it look more interesting and better, right? Like we would have... Oh, they're random, so every time they can be different ones. I like, I like, I like. Oh, cool. And we also have the wide one if we want to use that. I guess we can even have that outside. I'm not sure if that would be a good look or not, to have it like outside. It would probably get uh, hurt by the rain and everything. I once ate at a ramen place in Copenhagen that had a giant Pikachu. <laughs> That's cool. Did he also give you a Pikachu hat when he went in? <laughs> we can do Mewtwo. I think this one is from Settlement Decoration. Maybe we can have it inside here for fun. Like, I never use this, but maybe that would be suiting now that we're playing these guys. <laughs> and also a toy Mudkip. Both should be Pokemons. I don't know this Pokemon. I think I've seen it maybe sometime. Hello, Scarbrand. How are you, man? You are... Uh, let's see. Uh, or maybe I haven't yet. Let's see. I do think I can make you a Samurai, by the way. Wait, why do we have a toy Mudkip? I do think it's from Settlement to Decoration. Okay, you still need to be a level 3. We should have it ready, the thing, pretty soon, I think. I thought I already crafted it. Uh, by the way, why is this icon looking different than uh, the promotion thing? Let's see if I go inside of here, it, it looks like it's a shield instead. And I'm pretty sure I made one of these. Let's make another, I guess. Mudkeep is my favorite Pokemon starter next to uh, Torrid the Wig. Let me Google that. I'm not super much into Pokemon. Like, I, I know the basic Pokemon. Maybe that is a basic one. <laughs> uh, you take the Mudkeep to your house? Nice. One of the starter from the new Yenry. Uh, but basically, you make a nice shield, but it looks like a katana. It's sort of a stopgap solution f uh, till Ace makes talisman equivalent code. Okay. It started off uh, with the Kyo Kyo Kyogre Kyogre and Groudon. Nice. We beat the daily goal. Awesome. ELDR. Not ideal, but the best we have for now. Okay. Yes, look up the starters for Ruby and Sapphire. Okay, we don't do that. Oh, okay. <laughs> they look very different than old Pokemon. So like a blue orange one and then and there's like a bird, orange bird, and some green kind of thing. I'm not sure what kind of thing that is. Some reptile. So I'm guessing some uh, Nature Pokemon, the bird, I'm not sure, Earth maybe, something, and uh, water, I suppose. 
Uh, the latest, um, they released on um, Pokemon game pretty recent, right? Like a few months ago. Did they release that for like a PC as well on Steam? Because I remember, oh wait, I'm not even thinking about Pokemon. I, I do think I'm, it's Temtem I think about, I think. That game looks pretty fun and that should be on PC. I might consider getting that game. The new one is Sword and Shield that doesn't have those starter. Oh, Sword and Shield is also a new game, right? Is Sword and Shield on PC? I should have changed the colors here a little bit so it wouldn't be a single one. Uh, but we'll leave like it like that for now. Oh, so it's not for PC? Okay. I really do wish it was. I guess I gotta get on uh, Switch someday. So I'm gonna continue a little bit with this house. Uh, I got stuck a little bit with other things. <laughs> That's how it tends to go in this game. There's always something getting you stuck with things. Uh, but I need to have some crafting under here. But yeah, it does look like the building is very nice, uh, Wouter. It's so nice to see them not getting stuck a lot. They might get in this corner since that's a new piece that I made. But hopefully not. But the, the Switch is probably one of the, the only consoles that I'm really interested in. Like Xbox and PlayStation, it feels like it's just a weaker computer. <laughs> <laughs> I guess PlayStation has some exclusive, maybe Xbox does, but I do think many games nowadays, um, when it comes to Xbox, you can play directly on um, on your computer, right? At least through like the Microsoft Store or something like that. Uh, let's see where we're gonna have the door to this one. Only reason why I bought it was for the Pokemon Sword and Shield. Okay, nice. I do enjoy like Mario Kart 8, I really really like. Pokemon would probably also be pretty fun and um, I do want to try to sell the game for sure. Maybe we'll get level 3 soon with the uh, Scarbrand so it can be our Samurai. Nice, he's really close, nice. And that game is kind of bad compared to the older Pokemon game, okay. Oh, a Varanus. Maybe that will be a level 3 for us. I'm really loving this music. I hope to see more, like, um, more music when you're playing the game, like the normal music. And I wonder, will Serdane's uh, um, lower tier music at higher tier, will that mess up the sounds for this mod? Like it will play sounds it's not supposed to play with this mod? Such nice music. Only five hours in the traders back. I hope I'm not gonna miss it. <laughs> I'd almost need to make a mod that or someone that when a trader comes back these messages so they will be a lot loud like bing 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 like to really let you know that you're back or something. Or like trader has arrived. Yo You're level free now man. So that means uh, we should be able to make you our first samurai. Well, yeah, we got the Geomancer thing, I forgot about that. Uh, let's check out the Samurai first. Hello there, Scarbrand the Samurai. This nice weapon.
prefer dual wheeling. So is dual wheeling uh, Wouter, what you want to have uh, for the, um, the offhand thing? Which is normally the shield. And notice he gets the samurai top knot. Oh, like this thing, right? Very nice. Magnificent top knot. <laughs> oh, more invaders. Now I can test his new, new skills. Okay, dual wheelings for two swords. That's gonna look pretty awesome, actually, having two swords. So, you wanna be a dual wielder? Should make that possible if you want that. Then I think we can actually craft your... your second weapon already now. It's called a Tanto. Tanto Banto. <laughs> yeah, here we have it. Iron Tanto. Uh, this one should be possible to do now. Just one ironing it. If we have iron. Okay, we need to find some. Nice. It looks like we have the Herbless Staff finally. And we're going to look for some iron pretty soon. So our healer is going to be, the Daft Samurai would be pretty good with those stats, but uh, I do think you want to be a soldier, so I might go for Satoshi. Satoshi. Have you guys seen the anime Demon Slayer, by the way? Oh, Mihu. Mihu. Mihau. Mihu. Let's make uh, her our herbalist. She wants to be a lord, but she's not going to be one. Oh, you seen Demon Slayer? Did you like it? A hundred gold, that's expensive. It's good, but I still prefer Berserk. Okay. I really, really did enjoy Demon Slayer. I loved uh, a lot of the battle scenes in it. And the music to those battle scenes was pretty awesome. And it has some pretty cool transitions in the battles. With the music and everything. Katana is typically paired with an... Wakisashi? Wakisashi? Okay. Oh, we let's sell some Mithril. Nordling's Mithril is always useful to get some gold. Oh, I haven't seen Berserk. Maybe I should have a look sometime. I guess it's a lot more gore then. See, we have the copper brew ready. Maybe we can have this inside of one of our houses. A little bit too small though. It could maybe fit in this house. I'm just gonna have it, let's just have it inside the mountain like everything else. <laughs> we need to get some real houses for them later. I just tell you one thing, it's not for the pure heart, uh, a very very beautiful st That's nice. So, let's get our herbalist to do work. And uh, this is a thing with the gardens of a hearth where we can make some uh, some new plants and stuff. Pretty cool. This is a very violent story. Uh, the great is neat. Berserk is not very nice. It's very violent. Okay. Have you seen... Uh, uh, what's the name? Um, Vinland Saga with the Vikings? Maybe you like that one. I've only seen like... I think two episodes, so I still have a lot to watch in it, but uh, it does seem pretty promising. Oh, did you like it? Uh, bright Bell Seeds. I'm gonna make a few seeds, yes, so I can plant them around town. 
It feels sometimes it, like that is a better way for collecting herbs than actually having them on the farm. Actually, it's nice. So we need to craft a bunch of different things, but I'm going to start uh, with some uh, seeds because that's a good way to level in the beginning. Uh, let's maintain 10 of those. I guess we can do a few healing tonics. They're not very good though. Since we have a garden so half, we have all these like beautiful things. Did I miss the trader? I did miss the trader. I thought I would. <laughs> oh, you forgot to say hello to your girlfriend? <laughs> oh, we have the bones for Ratley. Nice. Ratley is very happy. She quickly grabs the materials, bones, bones. Behind her, Tordolf is finishing setting up camp. Ratley thanks them for a gift. He looks back for continuing. Bones, you make Ratley happy? Nice, we made her happy. Where do they have their camps? Oh, here. Ratley and Tordolf. Bones! <laughs> Yep, yeah, a little goblin camp there. Uh, I'm not, I'm not hostile with them yet, uh, but maybe we should be soon. Uh, let's promote uh, the samurai to be a soldier. Then we have three soldiers. Should be a, maybe a little bit easier. Still working on healer. Yeah, we, I just got uh, the herbalist now. Took a while uh, for me to level up my farmer. I don't know why really. <laughs> I only had like two people working with farming, but it took a long time. Don't believe in magic, but you believe in bones. <laughs> okay, so a second um, cook. Uh, let's go for Satoshi, because he do have some pretty good stats. Having high spirits is good for a cook, because higher chance of making higher quality food. Okay, nice. Now we have three soldiers. Two cooks. Oh, nice. We are actually able to make drinks. Let's see. We need three more people to be merry, and then we beat this one. And since we do have some sake now, they should be able to drink that and be happy. Well, let's take a little bit of a look. I haven't seen Wouter stuff for a while. So Wouter's playing over here is building two new houses, looking nice. It's almost later, like if we want to later, we can we could actually kind of make them to the same town really. For example, like here maybe in the back, I could open up later and we can have some stairs or something. If you want that. And because you already have your walls, right? Oh yeah, that's true. We can make an um, yeah, that's true. Make a road under it. And that could be a cool idea. I will, I will look into it later, but that could be nice. Since our houses do look like very similar, it kind of matches together. Those late gates looks neat. <laughs> Let's open the mail and got my new hunting license. It is red this season, so what does it mean if it's red? Let's get this guy down. Oh wow, that person have a big hat. <laughs> oh, it's the herbalist. Look at the big hat. Looks like a big mushroom, or like a big loaf of bread on his head, a big pie or something. Hello, mushroom man. <laughs> But I, I dig that one. That one is pretty cool. It really, really stands out. Let's see. Have we made some seeds? We're going to plant this to start with, I suppose. Um, I'm going to plant them outside this place, maybe. Or should we have it next to a house? 
Oh, like next to the well. I was supposed to decorate around here a bit, and uh, these do look pretty cool. Get a herbalist to work. One thing when you play with Aster is like, there's almost always something to do with Aster. There's so much things going on there. There's so much things you like to improve, like better tools, better armor, better clothing, better bags. <laughs> There's always something going on. It's pretty awesome. I look into upgrading your well. Better wells get high quality water, but I'm sure you knew that. Yeah, we definitely should look into that. That's right. Uh, let's make this um, into an, um, a wooden well, maybe? Or should we do a stone well? Is there a samurai armor? I do think there should be. Let's have a look. Uh, if you are not the dual wielding as a samurai, you can also wield these the different charms. Improve you. And uh, then we have uh, this one. That you can have on your head. Two different ones. And then we also have uh, these two. Better armor. So that's uh, level four blacksmith to do that one. Level 3 to do this one. This one is not that hard to do. And this one we sh should probably look into getting. So our Ashigaru can get some new headgear. But we need to find some more iron. A diamond well full of diamond. <laughs> Then we're going to come with some diamond pickaxes. Uh, let's look around a little bit for iron. Here we have some tin, copper, coal, some copper, and here we have some iron. Nice. Let's see how long this one continues, because it might go pretty far, this one. We use this thing, you can see how it goes, okay. I guess we have mine there. Let's make some natural stairs to go up instead of ladders. How's the um, uh, school thing going with you now, Sir Dane? Because you were teaching from home, right? Is it working out good? Might want to do something here later. We could do some like small towers or something. But we're gonna wait with that. We already got so many other things to do. <laughs> uh, let's me see. Do I have those red those seed? Juniper seeds. Oh, we do have some bright bell seeds. That's nice. So uh, I was thinking of planting them next to the well. I think I might actually move these later. They, they might be a little bit extreme for having here. Uh, but bright bells, maybe we can have them like outside the wall here or the entrance. And these bright bells, it feels like they would suit really nice, like those um, cherry blossoms would. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna see how much we lock the citizens. 42, I think we're gonna go maybe 20 would be good per player. Manually capping my amount of links to 10. Okay. But yeah, these walls did realize that they were built up pretty quick that way. Yeah, I remember that. 
It was a lot of trouble when you played Raya's children, when it uh, busted wood. Because you didn't have so much wood. <laughs> so it was pretty troublesome with Raya. Uh, let's see if um, we could continue a little bit with this one. Herbal is level 2, nice. Uh, let me see first if I can queue up to do uh, so we can get a cleric. 